Amanda, when it comes to art, the town of Pike Road has several ways that people of all ages can show their creativity, including next month's Youth Art Contest. Joining us in the studio is Pike Road Mayor Gordon Stone. Always good to see you. Tell us Thank about you, this Youth Art Contest. You know, just when you think the Art Council's come up with all the creative things that are out there, they, they throw a new one at us, and what a wonderful one this is. So every year we have the Plain Air Art Festival, which is coming up in October, the 19th through the 21st, and I hope people will come participate. It's 13 years of that. Well, this year, in order to prepare for that, Brantley Bank, along with our Art Council, have come together, and they've created an art contest for uh, young people in Pike Road up to age 12. And basically what they can do, they go by the bank, they pick up, pick up an application form, and then between now and September 6th, they can go find their favorite scene in Pike Road, but they have to draw it out or sketch it out. They can only use four colors, and they have to then submit it on an eight and a half by 11 sheet, turn it back into the bank by September 6th, and, and the bank will go through with some local artists and identify the top four uh, $100, $75, $50, $25 cash prizes, but then the winner gets to put their artistic uh, display on the back of the t-shirts for the plein air art event. So it's really cool because what we're seeing is this Art Council creating a very educational experience for all of our folks in Pike Road. And it starts with the local artists wanting to reach out and, and build that love for art in our young people. This is a great way to engage all those students you have in your growing school system. 10 years of Pike Road Schools this year, and what an amazing thing. And what we love about the way our school works is that they encourage people to be involved in the academic programs, the athletic programs, but then the community programs. And so working together, partners in business, partners, volunteers through the Art Council, which is one of our enhanced programs, and then the school. It's just a perfect community and engagement and strengthening program. You really focus equally on academics and the arts out there. And, and the this shows it, and you have some beautiful settings out there in Pike Road. I think you have some of the best sunsets out there. Well, we, we're very excited about that. We had the rodeo the other night, and I, I was walking around, and the sun was going down, and people were, were supposed to be watching the competitors, and they were watching the sunset, and I said, wow, that's a, that's a cool mm -hmm. extra benefit. But, you know, one of the things we want to do, though, is capture those moments, and that's why we have the Plain Air Festival. That's why this contest is such a really cool idea, and that's why we do the Hey, Look at Us, and don't forget, if you're in a neighborhood in Pike Road, you want to be a part of that program, you've got up to September 10th to turn in your application. We had 60 plus hay bales decorated okay. last year. Just another way that our kind of comprehensive engagement program involves the arts. I'm always amazed at what people can do with hay bales. Remind <laughs> us what that event exactly is. Well, it started, as, as I've told the story many times, it started by, by you know, Periodically, you ride down the road and you see a farmer who's turned a hay bale into a Halloween decoration or something like that. And what we decided, let's do, let's take it another level. And let's ask our neighborhoods to each get a hay bale and create something that says, this is why we love Pike Road, or this is why we love America, or this is what we love about this season of the year. And then what we do is we go get external judges to come in and they, they uh, kind of rank them by creativity, they rank them by messaging, all kinds of different categories and ultimately select a winner. But, but the fun part is over 1,000 people in the community, a community of 11,000, over 1,000 have been involved in, last year at least, in the preparation and the display and the building out of these hay bales. And that's 10% of your people in one program is amazing. It really is. And this is another way to take those natural resources you have out there in Pike Road and involve the entire com community. One of the things I love about it, too, is, you know, we have, a, we have a group of town centers. You know, we really, when we started our town, it was a bunch of residential uh, neighborhoods that came together. Never really had a downtown. But we had a bunch of really special crossroads. So we called those our town centers. Well, what this does is it allows people who, who go kind of riding around checking out all the hay bales, they visit all the different town centers. They get to know their community in a special way. So from the young kids from up to age 12 competing in the, the, the art contest through Brantley Bank to the, to the plein air professional artists to the neighborhood competition, uh, this will be a big, a big season for engaging people in all kind of creativity in Pike Road. There's always something happening out there yeah, in, in Pike you. Road. So September 6th, the deadlines to get those. Art, the, art. The, the children's art turned back mm -hmm. into Brantley.
bank. Go by the bank anytime, uh, Monday through Friday, when they're open, they'll give you the application. You've got to fill the form out. And we do ask you, when you submit your, your artwork back, to write a statement that says, this is why I love this scene. Because we want to capture that in the words of the artist, as well as kind of the imagination that goes along with viewing that art. And then the hay bale. Oh, yes, yeah. September 10th is the deadline for you to get your hay bale ordered, and then we'll have them delivered. So start organizing your team. Be creative. <laughs> it's going to be a lot of fun. Can't wait to see what folks come oh, up with this me. year. It's always great. It's yes. always good to see you. Thanks for joining Thank us. You, Sally.